you want to learn this sort of poster design today i'll show you how to make this sort of creative poster design in photoshop i'll show you step by step from the beginning to end let's get started if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications At first going to the file and going to the new options from here i'll take 2000 pixel and 2000 pixel 300 pixel per inch the artboard size and hit the create button you'll get this sort of square size image which is for the instagram facebook and so on and after that going to the solid color from the adjustment layer and you have to pick a color which is like this and you can choose that and hit ok and now you have to go to the text tool and write down the text which is the FASD first so I'll change the font like a speedy font or bevas type font which is like a thin so I'm providing here bevas like this or you can take this sort of font like this and after that press ctrl or command T make this one a little bit of bigger and press the shift and stretch this out don't stretch too much so i'll make stretch like that and just place over there good and now time to bring a car from the website which is the first fastest car and the most important is the top view so going to this option here is the top view of the car you can pick any sort of images so i'm taking this image copy this image and paste in a photoshop and bring that layer upper side of this and press ctrl or command t for transformation and i'll select this subject only going to the object selection tool and select the area of the car or you can just place or press that car and after that mask it out before that you can refine the edges select and mask and here smooth like 22 percent and the edge shifting minus 17 or like that and after that going to the downside and you will get the drop down menu over there and new layer or you can new layer with the mask and hit ok so you'll get only the car over there that's fine now deleting the previous layer and now i'll make this one apply layer mask that's fine press ctrl or command t make this one a little bit of like this this sort of perspective type that's good and now this first will be a little bit of like this and a little bit of like this that's fine and now i'll apply the shadow and everything right press and going to the blending options here the drop shadow should be like this and this actually you have to use this and select this drop shadow and keep this one like that and select this drop shadow and keep this one like that that's fine you can change up the size and everything according to your preferences so i'll show here the settings the distance will be 108 and the spread that is 8 size 114 and here the angle 141 and the opacity should be 66 percent and the blending mode will be multiply and the other drop shadow settings is like that 44 8 70 and 110 and 28 percent opacity and the blending mode will be multiply and you can change it out if you want suppose i want to change like this which is uh, good so when you are making this uh, it will be 1148 and 91 and hit okay that's fine now time to draw a line over there so going to the shape tool before that you have to pick up a color which is f23 b46 which is the color code and you can apply that code in your design as well so the rectangle tool draw a rectangle like that and keep the rectangle downside of this layer and after that 
press ctrl or command t for the transformation and now match the rectangle according to this and keep this one bigger or you can make this one smaller that's fine it will make sense yeah that's fine and hit the tick button you can make it a little bit of bigger if you want or you can place it out yeah that's fine and hit the tick button and after that this layer right press and create clipping mask it will clipping mask on a first letter meaning this font and it will make a train like that so this terrain will symbolize that this car is faster and according to the size of the car you you can change up the shape size and everything according to this so i would say this line won't uh, like cross this car it will be downside of this okay that's fine and now downside uh, right side text and everything so i just retain this sort of text like that copying that and ctrl or command v keeping that up press ctrl or command t make this one a little bit of bigger and here you can place over there so your post is ready and if you want you can change up the color of the background so in this case i'll take this color of the background the color code is b7 cd c4 copying that and hit ok and in our window i'll paste it out that's fine it will make the post vibrant and it will make the car pop up from the poster and so on and let's try this color what color i used here here is color code which is 63 so copying that color code and we are applying that color code into our post so that is same that's good now our post is ready you can save it out controller command s and save copy as and save as jpg and tutorial post and you'll get the uh, jpg uh, version uh, jpeg version you know that you can publish that jpeg into your uh, portfolio into the social media uh, meaning uh, jpg is supported file in a web format and you can post anywhere so if you want to make some like mock-up you have to go to the website and uh, search instagram mock-up so instagram mock-up you can get uh, any sort of instagram 3d type mock-up uh, in a website so let's pick up one of them so here is a website they are not paying me but uh, you can download from here i'm not uh, not uh, doing the paid promotion so you can download uh, from this website so here or this this okay they are not allowing me to download let's try another so here is another free website where you can get download from here okay the mockup is a presentation of real life super imp superimposed type so i'm downloading this download this one and here download so thank you for downloading it will uh, take a little bit of time and then i'll save it to my directory and save it out so download it going to that folder unzip that folder and here the psd format open within a photoshop and here the design double press in a smart object going to the file and going to the place embed options from here you can place that photo like this this one and control or command s and it will be the um, like a mock-up like that so you can change up the color according to this or you can use that color or use that color whatever color you can choose from this so i would suggest to use this sort of color it will make sense 
that's good or if you want you can use red as well but red is more vibrant which is uh, not uh, eye friendly so your design must be the eye friendly or eye soothing which is important for the audience and etc and then save this out in a jpeg version jpg and i am saving it in this portion and hit ok so we are getting our main design and the mock-up design you can represent this design or uh, these two file on, into your portfolio and the social media which is uh, more engaging to the audience and you can get uh, more reach to represent your design in this way so hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share to your friend and if you have any sort of questions query or request please do comment on my video comment section and don't forget to subscribe my channel for getting this sort of amazing tutorial from the beginning to the end until the next video is signing out stay safe stay healthy keep me in your prayers bye bye